Fumari Granny Smith review. How's it going? Matt from the shop. Glenn from the Coffin Cardinal. Today we are trying Granny Smith by Fumari. Um, like every other Fumari, definitely good, good clouds, good smokage. Um, we really have had one review yet where we haven't had that, but you know. Um, We're professionals. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, the, definitely open the bag. It smells like a Granny Smith or like the Green Jolly Ranchers, whichever one that you relate to more. Um, yeah, from the little bit I have, I wasn't wasn't hogging the hose. It was definitely um, pretty delicious. Um, I like the splitter. Oh, hey, my turn. What should we talk about? Um, you know, so far from all the Fumari flavors I've tried, um, I kind of cheated a little bit. I've done, I've tried some flavors that we haven't done a video for yet, but um, they're, yeah. they're soon to come. Without me. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, really all part the, of the team here, Lynn. All the flavors I've tried so far There's have no been R -N -T -A -M. exactly what they say on the package. Um, this flavor is, is nothing different. I mean, it tastes, tastes like green apple to me. That's delicious. Yeah. Which, I mean, I know it's difficult because whenever you go in the store and you're you're looking at Fumari and you're like, oh, what does it smell like? And you don't know because it's totally sealed. I mean, it smells like how you think it's going to, which yeah. is nice because yeah. I know like some brands aren't quite like that. Like with Alfaka, it's kind of like a mystery. You know, you're just like, oh, I wonder what this tastes like, and you've got to you've got to actually try it. But um, I mean, with this, I mean, it's it's exactly what you would expect. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a green apple. Yeah. They definitely um, definitely nailed it with this flavor. Um, so if you like like the sour apples, like your green Granny Smith apples, I think you'll definitely enjoy this over like a sweet apple. So I thought they did a good job too with kind of capturing that tartness of it too. Like it's still got kind of a sweetness to it, but not completely. I like how they did. They did a good job. As far as apple flavors go, I'm, I'm usually not uh, not up to try an apple flavor because it seems like all of them have that black licorice like undertone and I'm not I'm not a fan of it. It's but actually a nice. Whatever. Uh, it tastes like black licorice. I don't like black licorice. This one doesn't taste like black licorice. Yeah, not, which not is whatsoever. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. It, it tastes straight tastes like, like a green apple, apple. Yeah, yeah. I'm pretty impressed. Which is why I'm excited to try their uh, their Fakina and also uh, some of their other apple flavors too. Martin has a lot of apple flavors. So the fuck uh, fuck fahina, fuck fahina. That's what you're, it's yeah. Called. You're gonna have to get that down. Yeah, fuck fahina. I apologize for saying it wrong. We'll get to that when we get to it. Um, this is actually Granny Smith. Not to get yes. confused. Yeah. Not to get confused. This is Granny Smith. But there are a lot of apple flavors we will be trying in the future, including. I guess I'm just gonna have to deal with it and try all the double apple flavors because there's so many of them, and we just need to. We need to compare them all. Yeah. Okay, it wouldn't be fair to just compare like one of them and be like, oh, this is good. Yeah, no, I agree. I agree. Got to compare them all, but I'm definitely a fan of the green. Like, I like the uh, green with apples. So this is right on my alley. What's your? Uh, I guess I'll go first as far as reviews go. <sighs> Review wise, um, as far as rating it, man, I don't know. I'd have to. Like I said, like I love the green apple taste it has. Um, uh, I'd probably almost go like 85 of the. Actually, I'd probably go 87 on this one. Probably my favorite one so far, by far. Um, or by a little bit, I guess. But anyway, either way, it's delicious. Um, definitely one that I will smoke a lot more of in my spare time, which isn't very often. But uh, yeah, if you like green apples, definitely try this one. My, my personal opinion. I'm going to rate it like an 82. Um, because I feel like Prickly Pear was significantly better. I mean, it's one of my favorites. Um, but uh, this is definitely good. You know, either way, I mean, it's, it's really close behind it. Um, I think it's going to be hard to uh, 
score all their all their flavors because they're all going to be fairly high, and I don't want to <laughs> I don't want to give them all the same rating, you know. Yeah. Um, but they're all they're all fantastic so far. Yeah, I think mine was higher just because I like the the green apple. Yeah. Like, yeah. Um, I think the only reason mine was more um, on this one especially. So, but like I said, everyone's flavor is different. So we don't like green apples. So we have to really understand. I'm not a mango or peach fan. So, but uh, yeah, definitely try it out. Um, don't be disappointed. That's for sure. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right, we are done here. So. More reviews to come in the future. Who knows what's next? I don't know. Check it, man. They're always going up. Yeah, always going up. Always going up. Up and up. Up and up. Uh, I don't know what he's saying. Anyway, talk to you guys later. See you, guys. ladies. Bye. See you. Evening. Buenos noches.